The structure of the Pakistan Army can be broken down two ways, administrative, and operational. Operationally, the Pakistan Army is divided in 11 corps having areas of responsibility from mountainous regions of northern Pakistan to the desert, and coastal regions of the south. Administratively it is divided in different regiments. The general headquarters of Pakistan Army is located in the garrison city of Rawalpindi in Punjab province. It is planned to be moved to the capital city of Islamabad. Army headquarters and staff. The chief of the army staff, formerly called the commander-in-chief, is challenged with the responsibility of commanding the Pakistani army. The COAS operates from Army Headquarters in Rawalpindi, near Islamabad. The principal staff officers assisting him in his duties at the Lieutenant General level include Chief of General Staff, LT Gen Zabem Mahmood Hayat, Chief of Logistics Staff, LT Gen Gayur Mahmood, Inspector General Arms, LT Gen Obaidullah Khan, Adjutant General, LT Gen Zamir Al Hassan Shah, Quartermaster General, LT Gen Javad Mahmood Bukhari, Inspector General Training and Evaluation, LT Gen Kamar Javad Bajwa, Military Secretary, LT Gen Shahid Beg Mirza, Inspector General Communications and IT, LT Gen Nazir Ahmed Butt. The Military Operations and Intelligence Directorates function under the Chief of General Staff. A major reorganization in GHQ was done in September 2008 under General Ashfaq Parvez Kiani, when two new PASEO positions were introduced. The Inspector General Arms in the Inspector General Communications and IT, thus raising the number of PSOs to eight. The headquarters function also includes the Judge Advocate General and the Controller of Civilian Personnel. The Chief of the Corps of Engineers who is also Head of Military Engineering Service, all of them also report to the Chief of the Army Staff. Operational Structure Hierarchy Corps A corps in the Pakistani Army usually consists of two or more divisions and is commanded by a Lieutenant General. Currently the Pakistani Army has 11 corps. The 11th one is the recently raised Army Strategic Force Command, responsible for bearing the national strategic and nuclear assets. Initially a division, but then raised to the status of a corps. Division. Each division is commanded by a major general and usually holds three brigades including infantry, artillery, engineers and communications units in addition to logistics support to sustain independent action. Except for the divisions operating in the mountains, all the divisions have at least one armored unit. Some have even more depending upon their functionality. The most major of all ground force combat formations is the infantry division. Such a division would primarily hold three infantry brigades. There are 19 infantry divisions, one special operations elite combat para infantry division raised to a division size group, two mechanized infantry divisions, two armored divisions, one engineers division, two artillery divisions in the Pakistani army. Brigade. A brigade is under the command of a brigadier and comprises three or more battalions of different units depending on its functionality. An independent brigade would be one that primarily consists of an artillery unit, an infantry unit, an armor unit and logistics to support its actions. Such a brigade is not part of any division and is under direct command of a corps. Battalion. Each battalion is commanded by a lieutenant colonel and has roughly 600 to 900 soldiers under his command. This number varies depending on the functionality of the battalion. A battalion comprises either three batteries or four companies each under the command of a major and consisting of individual subunits called sections. Corps There are 11 corps located at various garrisons all over Pakistan. Armored divisions, infantry divisions, air defense divisions, artillery divisions, independent brigades. There are 7 independent mechanized infantry brigades, 8 independent armored brigades, 4 artillery brigades, and 9 engineer brigades. 
These include 105 Independent Brigade Group in 31st Corps, 111 Independent Infantry Brigade at Royal Pindu with 10th Corps, 212 Infantry Brigade at Lahore with 4th Corps and 105 Independent Infantry Brigade under 5th Corps. Nine Independent Signal Brigade Groups are also present. Former formations Eastern Command was a core-level formation in the former East Pakistan consisting of 14th, 9th and 16th Infantry Divisions. All three were re-raised after the war and exist today. 14 ID pretty much did not fight, since it was heavily Bengali and six of its battalions deserted when the operation began. 36 ID and 39 ID were raised to command the paramilitary troops and a few loyal battalions, were later reinforced with a couple of other battalions each. They were not re-raised after the war. Administrative structure The Pakistani army is divided into two main branches, which are arms and services. Infantry, armor, artillery and army air defense The army's infantry force includes two special forces brigades with five battalions. The Pakistan Armored Corps includes eight armored reconnaissance regiments, while the air defense also includes three strategic defense and twelve self-propelled regiments Asterisk The president's bodyguard formed at independence from members of the governor-general's bodyguard itself successor to the governor's troop of Mothals raised in 1773 asterisk fifth horse is the successor to the first Sikh irregular cavalry and the second Sikh irregular cavalry, both raised in 1857 asterisk sixth lances is the successor to the Rohil Kand horse raised in 1857 and the 4th Sikh Irregular Cavalry raised in 1858 Guides Cavalry is the successor to the Corps of Guides raised in 1846 11th Cavalry is the successor to 1st Regiment of Punjab Cavalry and 3rd Regiment of Punjab Cavalry both raised in 1849 13th Lancers is the successor to the 1st Native Troop raised in 1804 and the 2nd Native Troop raised in 1816. It is also the senior most armor regiment of the Indian subcontinent. Asterisk 19th Lancers is the successor to the 2nd Maratha horse raised in 1858 and fans horse raced in 1860 25th cavalry is the famous unit which stopped indian armor thrust in chawinda in 1965 29th cavalry regiment nicknamed as royal bengal tigers was the armored regiment stationed in former east pakistan entire regiment was lost in 1971 war and was raised later with nickname of tigers Currently the regiment forms part of 6th Armoured Division and is stationed in Carrion. Asterisk 6 Light Air Defense is the famous unit which downed more than 36 IAF fighter jets during Battle of Dhaka in 1971. It was the first ever anti-aircraft regiment of the United India raised in 1912. Asterisk 5 Light Air Defense was the first ever army unit to be inspected by Quaidi Azam Muhammad Ali Jinnah founder of the nation in 1948. This unit can be traced back to 125th Royal Heavy Anti-Aircraft Artillery raised at Woolwich, England in 1918. 19 SP Air Defence was the first self. Propelled air defense unit attached to armored formation Asterisk 153 SP air defense raised in 1990 took active part in Operation Desert Storm in 1991 over Saudi Iraqi border and intercepted number of Iraqi Scud surface to surface missiles Asterisk the Punjab regiment formed in 1956 from the 1st, 14th 15th and 16th Punjab regiments can be traced back to the 3rd Battalion of Coast Sepoys raised in 1759 asterisk the Balak regiment formed in 1956 from the 8th Punjab regiment the Balak regiment 
and the Bahawalpur Regiment, can be traced back to the 3rd Extra Madras Battalion raised in 1798. The Frontier Force Regiment is the successor to the Frontier Brigade raised in 1846. The Azad Kashmir Regiment was raised in 1947, became part of the Army in 1971. The Sindh Regiment was raised in 1980 from battalions of the Punjab Regiment and Balak Regiment Asterisk the Northern Light. Infantry was formed in 1977 from various paramilitary units of scouts, became part of the army in 1999 after the Kargil War Asterisk the Special Service Group was formed in 1959 around the cadre from the Balak Regiment Combat, Arms Corps of Armor, Corps of Artillery, Corps of Infantry, Corps of Engineers, Corps of Signals, Corps of Army Aviation, Services Army Ordnance Corps, Corps of Electrical and Mechanical Engineering, Army Service Corps, Army Education Corps, Corps of Military Police, Remount, Veterinary, and Farming Corps, Army Medical Corps, Corps of Military Intelligence.